common issue. Weather strip starts ripping on the bottom. So people put their feet over there. Actually, had a tow truck at work. It was all hanging, and the uh, place we worked for would refuse. I told them how to fix it. I'm like, get some glue. I'll fix it. They don't want to spend like four dollars in weather strip adhesive. So what you do is you clean it all up the best you can. Put a little bit of that weather strip adhesive on either side. I might vacuum this out first because I'm crazy. And uh, seal it back up. Hardens pretty good. Be like good as new. Weather strip adhesive. And what you do is you just fill that back, put a little bit on here, like I did. There you see it's already starting to set up. You don't need much. It should be pretty strong when it dries. Super glue also works, but I don't know, I didn't have any super glue. So I'm trying an alternative method. I might come back to and just put a little fill piece right in the top. And uh yeah, no more rip. Saved it. A lot of times it rips over here too if you're a fat guy or a big guy. Some will get offended because I said fat guy. But yeah, that's how you know a big person drove the car. It's always torn up over there because they drag their ass and they tear it up. Which you might notice too if you just keep peeling it back, you just start chasing like a cracked area. See, that's where it releases where it was glued. That's where it always will rip. So if you just keep pulling it back, you'll find some more weak spots. So as you see, my area is very small, but I started peeling it back and it increased in size. You know, it's going to be a little whatever in here. I really should have put some masking tape down if I wanted it perfect. And then it would have no overflow. But, whatever, look at it. It's probably just going to wind up ripping over here. We're going to wind up replacing it in a short time. But, better than what it was. You just don't have any lizards getting down there. This stuff sets up pretty quick, too. So, probably within like an hour would be pretty damn hard. But I like it. It's good enough. Better than what it was. Stronger repair. So that's how you glue your ripped weather stripping back together. The next you'll clean the dust off our OBD2 port. <laughs> and a parking brake and a gas panel. Yeah, right.